Hey, what's up guys? This is Mossack Tech and this is Samsung Galaxy Note 1. I am on a custom ROM which is unofficial signed and model only. Today I will show you how to install this kind of ROM, any kind of custom ROM. So you can see device model is GT and 7000 and uh, you can see I am currently on Sanger mode version but you can do the process same uh, with the uh, official stock ROM which is Jelly Bean for the uh, Galaxy Note and 7000 I mean Galaxy Note 1 so how to do this just uh, first of all download uh, three files uh, first one is a custom ROM you want uh, you can choose any custom ROM I have many links in the description box and uh, these are the gaps for the KitKat and uh, you can see uh, these are the gaps for KitKat and also you have to download gaps for Lollipop if you want to install Lollipop custom ROM and the last one is the KitKat uh, and Lollipop uh, compatible recovery so you have to flash this recovery on the previous recovery I have made a previous video you can watch that out first of all you have to watch that and after that you have to watch this video uh, to install the custom ROM so first of all hold the power key volume up key and the home key at the same time so let me remove this a cover from this so it will be more compatible now you can see the Samsung Galaxy Note N7000 now press volume up key power key and the home key at the same time on the screen on time so the screen is on and then hold this for few seconds and don't leave the keys uh, when the device uh, will off and uh, ho again hold it and uh, holding it and now leave it when you see the booting logo and after that you will redirect it to the recovery file and now the touch fields custom recovery I have made a video how to install this you have to install first this and you and then you can do all the process so you can watch that video how to install this so first of all click on install zip and choose zip from file go to SD card internal storage and scroll down and choose this compatible lollipop zip file and kitkat zip file this is a recovery and you have to flash this click on it and click on yes yes and it will install in few seconds so now it's installed and now go back and then click on power setting power option and then go to reboot to recovery and it will reboot to the new recovery which we have installed right now now click on this reboot recovery and uh, you have to install the ROM from that you can't able to install this ROM from this recovery because it will not allow you to install this so now click on that uh, and uh, you will reboot to the recovery wait for few seconds more and now you are in the clock clock mode based recovery so now this will allow you to install custom ROM and gaps file now first of all we have to wipe data factory set First, make sure you back up your contacts and the photos in your PC or in the Google account. Now, click on this wipe all user data and after that, press back and go to wipe cache partition. Press the volume key to scroll down, power key to select it, and yes. And then click on mounts and, uh, mounts and storage and then click on format system. Yes format the system and then go again format data and also there is a first option which is mount uh, mount system on mount system click on the unmount system and mount it I have already mounted it in the first option you can see here now press go back and then with the last important option head it up to, up to advanced now click on advanced and choose wipe Dalvi cache and now click go back and click on install zip zip from the SD card and then scroll down scroll down scroll down and choose your custom ROM which we want to install this is an official signature mode I'm gonna install KitKat ROM because Lollipop is uh, too buggy for this now and also the signature mode 11 is stable I click on it and install it wait for few seconds or minutes it will install in minimum two minutes wait for it and I'm skipping the video and now it has been installed now pick up phone again and now it has been installed okay installed from SD card is completed now scroll down and and choose install zip from SD card and then scroll down this time you have to flash the gaps 
flash the KitKat gaps if you are installing KitKat custom ROM flash lollipop gaps if you are installing lollipop custom ROM you can download uh, the gaps from the link in the description box according to you want and click on install gaps and uh, wait for a few minutes now it will it has been installed now go back what you have to do this time you have to reboot your device click on reboot device and now wait for few minutes to rebooting i'm skipping the video and fast forwarding it and it will take five minutes up to ten minutes so don't panic and now the setup process is here now let's set let us set up the language english india and click on next and now choose your wi-fi connection i'm skipping all these things because I don't want to add a Google account right now I will add it later skip this and you want to set up a, uh, in this time you can set up set it up but I am skipping this click on next set your time uh, okay time is correct now finish okay it's a bit lagging up in the beginning but it will run smooth after it so you can see it's running good so let us go to the settings from the above let me open the notification panel let's go to the settings and see the about version about phone and see the android version is 4.4.4 kitkat which is a higher kitkat version and you can see it's kitkat version you can also see the sign and mode kitkat version from here and you can uh, also enable up the developer option from this ROM click on build number seven times and then press go back and you will see real developer option you can enable the root access from here you can root the device click on apps only or apps and adb you want to and android debugging also on. so now these are many these have many features now holding down the screen screen and you will see more options from here and you can change the wallpaper scroll effect everything you want so that's the guy thanks for watching uh, if you like this video leave a thumbs up down below and also comment in the comment box if you have any question uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more tech videos and uh, share this video with friends i will catch you guys in my next one <laughs>